You probably think that if you can't roll your tongue, it's because of genetics. Nah, that's not true. You're just not good at it. But don't worry, there's probably something you're good at. Like stamp collecting, going through celebrities' garbage cans, or converting oxygen into carbon dioxide. That's breathing. Hey everybody, I'm Patrick Jones and welcome to Buzz 60. So previous studies say that between 65 and 81% of people can roll their tongue, and the leftovers have poor genetics. That's not true according to several studies. The most recently happened at the University of Delaware. So I guess just work on it and maybe you'll get it. Just don't do that in public. The lead on the tongue story, John H. McDonald, says he's debunked other genetic myths too. One that says there's an attached versus detached earlobe gene, another that says two red-haired people can't have a child with another hair color, and another that says two blue-eyed people can't have a kid with brown eyes. It seems McDonald's goal is to prove the great philosopher Jeff Goldblum's theory on life. Life, uh, finds a way. Except when it comes to doing splits, life would much rather sit on the couch without a groin injury. But 60, now you know, pass it on.